Hey guys, it's the SB001 here. Welcome you to the fifth video in the positive or attempting positive KD ratio with every gun in the game. Which I can already tell you is not going to end up happening because I can't snipe for crap, especially with the dragon on. But anyway, this match, the Striker, the Striker is the fifth shotgun. It is a beast, to say the least. It is a 12 round clip, very fast semi automatic. It's a beast. It just is. Pretty quick reload time too, but it's it's got good range. It's extremely fast firing. It's like it's a one to three hit kill. Nah, I just got killed by that stupid spawn camper type guy. But uh, it's got a 12 round clip. It's very powerful, very fast. It's a great weapon. It's great for infected modes whenever you get to use it. So definitely a good weapon. I think I get a kill with that guy on. On that guy with the grenade or something. There's a guy over here. Let's see. Let's beast the shotgun. Yep, two hit kill from a relatively far away. So it's got better range than a lot of the shotguns, which is nice. I mean, I just two hit killed him from pretty pretty realistic range. Taken the lead. But uh, with the spat, excuse me, not the spat 12. Uh, the striker. Its advantages, of course, are the high clip size and the pretty good power and range. There really aren't any disadvantages specific to this weapon versus the other shotguns. I mean, honestly, it's the best shotgun in the game, in my opinion. Although, I personally, I know you guys might criticize me for this, but I personally like the USAS a little bit better. I don't know, I feel like it's a little more powerful. I personally like it just a little more than the Striker. That's just the way I feel. I know you guys probably will criticize me for that. That's just how I feel. I like the USAS a little bit better because it, it almost always seems to one hit kill. It rarely ever takes two hits to kill. This one usually takes two hits to kill. But it's faster, which makes sense. So we're playing on uh, Bakara here. I don't have any proficiencies on it either. Like, I don't even have the damage proficiency on it though. I don't have the damage proficiency on anything. And my grenade, of course, misses. Ah. Uh, I guess he's checking out my channel with some of these guys playing online with earlier today. Uh, anyway. It's a good weapon, though. I mean, in the end, I would probably rate... I'm going to speed it up now because not much... It's just another long match. I get on a pretty good kill streak, though. But, uh, the Spaz... Or, God, I keep on the Spaz 12 because they both start the S. Striker is just a great shotgun all around. I would probably rate it like an 8 out of 10 is my personal opinion. I think most people will probably rate it like a 9-ish. I just told you guys I like the USAS a little bit better after trying out all the shotguns. That's just how I feel. I don't know. I guess you guys maybe don't feel that way, but that's how I feel. And I just, I really like the USAS a little bit better. But this is a good weapon, by all means. If you like the Striker better, then there's nothing wrong with it because it's such a good gun. Do not blame you at all. And then we get a uh, stealth bomb right here. I don't think we get too much out of it. One kill. I knew there was a guy up there, so I tracked him into it. Heal up a little bit there. Kill that guy. Now there it took a few more shots, but the striker, unlike you know the Spaz 12 or the KSG, is very consistent with how many shots it takes. One to three shots, which really the difference in time to take those shots is not really so much that it would actually matter. So I get my EMP right in the last second. He get it in like three kills from the win, and we win. And he kills with the helicopter for the final kill. So I finished 19 and 6, which is definitely a positive KD ratio, and second on the team. So, pretty good. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Next time, my death sentence of the shotguns. See you guys then.